There are hundreds of known varieties of ulu, or breadfruit, throughout the Pacific. Several dozen varieties can be found in Hawaii today. In this video, we will discuss primary characteristics of some of the most common varieties and discuss their pros and cons from a commercial farming and processing perspective. Hawaiian Ulu Maoli, also known as Hawaiian Ulu, is the variety believed to have been brought to Hawaii around 1250 AD by Polynesian voyagers. The fruit of Hawaiian Ulu is typically oblong, large, dense, starchy, and seedless. Hawaiian trees can grow very tall and should be pruned regularly for ease, safety, and efficiency of harvesting. Otea Otea is a Tahitian variety very similar to Hawaiian ulu. Its fruit is dense, large, and seedless, but more round, even slightly horizontal, in shape. The fruit stem is also short, making it more challenging to harvest. Otea trees seem to grow slower and have less woody growth than Hawaiian ulu. It is important to shape them well through pruning. These trees also appear to be slightly more susceptible to fruit rot and other diseases, which may result in part from the deep groove that often appears around the stem, providing an entry point for pathogens. Ulufiti Ulufiti is a Fijian variety of breadfruit. Its fruit are large, round, yellowish in color, and seeded. Its flesh has a delicious creamy consistency and a much lighter density than Hawaiian ulu or otea. Ulu fiti trees like to have a single leader, making them harder to prune. This variety also likes to shoot upwards after pruning, so shaping the tree into the ideal shape for harvesting is difficult. Ma'afala Ma'afala is a beloved Samoan breadfruit variety. The fruit develops a consistent egg shape and is yellow-green in color. Although this variety tends to produce smaller fruit than others, it is a prolific producer. The trees also have a naturally bushy shape, making them easier to manage and harvest. However, fruit abortion tends to be more prevalent among ma'afala trees, especially when under stress. Lipit The lipit variety is originally from Micronesia. Its fruits are very distinctive, large, and bumpy with an extremely light, fluffy texture. The seasonality of lipit is also slightly offset compared to other common varieties, which can help spread out production. Maopo Maopo is a popular variety of breadfruit from Samoa and Tonga. Its fruit is dense, oblong, and seedless similar to Hawaiian ulu, but more yellow in color. It is not relatively prolific and is harder to propagate as it produces less root shoots and is proven to not take well to air layering as other varieties. Its leaves are very distinctive by their lack of or shallow segmentation. Puo. Puo is a favorite ulu variety in Samoa, Fiji, and Tonga. The fruit is large, round, and bumpy, with skin that feels distinctly like sandpaper on the outside. The flesh is dense, usually seedless, and easy to process. However, it can be challenging to identify fully mature fruit on the tree. The variety also presents disease management challenges, as it tends to be more susceptible to pathogens, like Phytophthora.
This information has been collected from farmer observations around Hawaii, the Breadfruit Institute, and a network of variety trial sites through the Indigenous Cropping System Laboratory in the College of Tropical Agriculture and Human Resources at UH Manoa. Trials are ongoing. Make sure to check back with the Hawaii Ulu Kwa for more information about different varieties of Ulu in the future.